Hey guys, let's read a book. How to Get Rid of Bad Dreams by Nancy Hasbury and Roy Condy. How to Get Rid of Bad Dreams. Did you ever dream you were being chased by a scary ghost uttering horrible moans and groans? Sometimes bad dreams can make you afraid, but there are ways to make bad dreams and scary monsters go away. Here is the secret. If you dream you are being chased down a lonely road by a bunch of ugly monsters with pointy horns and jagged teeth and terrible claws, don't worry. All you have to do is take a mirror out of your pocket and hold it in front of them. When the monsters see themselves, they'll be so scared they'll turn around and run the other way. <laughs> If you dream you're walking in the park on a sunny afternoon when a huge dragon jumps out at you from behind a bush and tries to fry you with his fiery breath, don't worry. All you have to do is pull your shrink ray laser out of your belt and fire until the dragon shrivels to the size of a kitten. Then you can be the only one in school with your own pet dragon. If you dream you get lost in the jungle and step into quicksand up to your waist and every move just makes you sink deeper and deeper, don't worry. All you have to do is take off your hat and have a sip from the bottle of reducing potion in your knapsack. Soon you'll be small enough to fit in your hat and you can row to safety. <laughs> if you dream you're being attacked by 199 billion black, scary, hairy bugs with green eyes and red stingers, don't worry. All you have to do is whip out a can of silver paint and spray it all over the bugs. Then take a deep breath and blow them into the sky. That will make 199 billion new glittering stars. If you dream you're just sitting down to lunch after climbing the highest mountain in the world and suddenly a fierce wind starts to blow you right over the edge into a bottomless crevice and you have, and you have dropped your pick and your rope is getting frayed, don't worry. All you have to do is chew six pieces of really sticky bubble gum, stick a great wad on the bottom of each foot and walk back down the mountain. <laughs> Very sticky. If you dream that a warty, bristly, ugly troll captures you and laughs at all your efforts to escape, don't worry. All you have to do is laugh right back at him as loud and as long as you can. Soon you won't know why you were so scared of him and you might even become friends. <laughs> <laughs> if you dream you're trapped inside a giant's nose and it's dark and you can't find your way out, don't worry. All you have to do is reach for your flashlight and, oh no, you dropped it. Hold on, don't worry. All you have to do is borrow a feather from your pet parrot and tickle the inside of the giant's nose. He'll sneeze so hard, he'll blow you right out. Then use your umbrella as a parachute to float safely down to earth.
If you dream that a scary ghost uttering horrible moans and groans, a bunch of ugly monsters with pointy horns and jagged teeth and terrible claws, a huge dragon with fiery breath, 199 billion scary hairy bugs with green eyes and red stingers, and a warty bristly troll are chasing you and you are stuck in bottomless quicksand in the jungle, in a fierce wind at the top of the highest mountain in the world, or in the dark inside a giant's nose. And if you can't figure out what to do, don't worry. All you have to do is grab your teddy bear and your blanket and your older sister or brother and your dog or cat then run like mad and jump into bed with mummy or daddy or grandma or grandpa then snuggle deep under the soft warm covers and have sweet dreams the end how to get rid of bad dreams by nancy hasbury and roy condy <laughs> that was a fun one